Hello, I'm Jerome Payne and welcome back to Out There Oceans of Time, where of course in the first episode we managed to find where we were attacked and we've captured one of the ships that was left there and we've fixed it up. I'm a little worried though about that. We swapped it for this old ship that we had on the first planet. Uh, the main problem we've got is that we don't have an energy probe, or sorry, a hydrogen probe, which I need to collect fuel, and I only have 30 fuel and nothing spare in the reserves, and I need iron to be able to get that. Uh, the same with the telescope and the geoscanner, but I've got the silicon and I've got the copper for those. It's just iron that I'm missing, um, so we're going to have to try and find a planet that has that. These are oxygen planets, so they're probably not going to have what we need, but it might just be worth visiting one. It's only two fuel. Hmm. Two fuel and the hull is... Uh, sorry, the oxygen is going to take a bit of a hit. We might get it, might, like, might get lucky and get a little bit of iron off there, but I don't think we will. And then we could go to another... Oh, that's only one fuel away. Okay. We need, that, we need that probe because without that we can't get fuel. So that is our priority. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this planet here because... Oh, that... All right. That, that's a bit odd because that costs two fuel. I'm here. That costs two fuel. But that one over there costs two as well. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to go that. Oh, well, never mind. doesn't really matter. Yeah, you'd have thought the one that was really close to me would cost like one fuel or something rather than... No matter where you travel in the solar system. Yeah, there's a geo scan, but I don't have that. So that's going to cost me four to land, probably four to take off. Oh boy, this is going to be really tight. This might be the run over. <laughs> you know, we may, we may fail this one pretty quickly. Um, I think I dumped all my iron into the hull when I should have actually used it to build the probe. Uh, warning the shit. Yeah, I know. That's fine. Let's set the drill off. I think I'm largely just going to get oxygen from here. Yeah, we got some copper, which is great, but, you know, don't really need all that. Well, we'll dump the oxygen. Oh, okay. Um, oh, crap. I really need that oxygen. I'm tempted to dump these plants off because I don't have any use for them yet. I would like to dump that in there, but I don't have any, and then I don't have any way of fixing that. I'd like a cargo slot, but again, iron is just killing me right now, so... I need the thorium. We could get rid of the tungsten. Hafnium. Yeah, just get rid of that. I, I need that oxygen. Uh, we, we are full on it, but I think we'll take that more than the other thing. And then, you know, we'll need the tungsten in a minute. Watch that. Um, right, so let's take off. That's going to get four. And then we're going to go to the next solar system. We need, oops, sorry, the next uh, solar system along. Oh, crap, no, that's mine. Hang on, I want to go there. I, I need a rocky planet. If there's no rocky planet here, we're going to have to jump. I think that's our only option. Yes, there's a rocky planet. Oh, yes. Yes, I can get, hopefully I can get some. <laughs> hopefully I can get some iron and get a probe together. And then at least we can get fuel. That's the main thing. It'd be nice to get the geo scanner and the other things as well. Uh, there's like three anomalies down there as well, so there's three sectors uh, that we could land on. But yeah, look at that fuel. Yeah, I think that's it. Did that just... Hang on, how much did that cost me? To fly there? Ultra probe recommended. Yeah, I, I think we're doomed on this one. Alright, well, we'll land. Yeah, we're not going to be able to take off. Yeah, that's it. Game over, I think. <laughs> I think that was it. Yeah, I made a mistake on that one. I think taking this one was fine, but I needed that hydrogen probe. Although, we may have been screwed anyway with the fuel. Uh, it just depends whether we um, whether we found any fuel or not. Oh, wow. Can I only do that? Okay. All right. There we are. So, platinum. Oh, that does, oh, that does oxygen. Oh, interesting. Oh, boy. Um... Can I chuck that in there? Get rid of some of that. I, I desperately need some uh, space. Can I fix that? Turn that into that. And then I can put that in there. And then if we make the probe, that's good. And then we could make we could make the geo scanner. Fuel we're kind of screwed on, so yeah, I think we I think this might be over, but. I'm going to make the geo scanner. Why not? We might as well make it. And then we can put that into there. 
And then, yeah, everything's doing oxygen and the hull, which is fine. But, yeah, we don't don't desperately need that. I need fuel. Um, hmm. What happens if I try and take off? Because expedition, I can't do anything. I guess I could... Dr oh, do I need fuel for the... Oh, I need fuel to drill. <clears throat> okay. All right, well, I think this is probably game over. Do you want to uh, do you want to attempt an all or nothing? Yeah, I think it's game over because I don't have anything. So, yeah. Okay, all right, well, let's attempt an all or nothing. Yeah, there we go. Lost forever, game over. There we are. That's kind of what I figured. Um, yeah, there we go. All right, well, I'm going to skip the tutorial this time because, yeah, that was a mess. And uh, we'll just skip like 10, 15 minutes of gameplay. So we should be back outside. We need to go back to the area of attack again. And we're back in our ship again. So, yeah. Earlier, that was not good. Uh, black hole, that doesn't sound appealing, but... Let's make out... Oh, out of range? Really? Oh, yeah. It looks like it's in range, but it's not. Uh, let's go there, shall we? Yeah, I kind of figured that. I think I dumped all of my resources into that. Into the hull, and I didn't have a probe. Although, I didn't find a gas giant either, so... But without the, uh, without, without the probe, the gas giant would have been useless anyway. So, yeah. There we go. Roguelike for you. So, um, just like Trigon game over very quickly so yeah um let's come here though we could scan let's do the scans we might as well because you know why not uh where are we this way no further in the uh, there we go anomaly and then there's three on this one so we've got one anomaly and this should give us three different missions of varying difficulty. Okay, no, no, that was back there somewhere. Go over here. No. Is it back? Okay, all right. Didn't think it was going to be that close. Fair enough. So we've got three to choose from. So we've got that one. That's a one star. We get some minerals. We get some omegas. Uh. Ah. Yeah, we don't have anybody that does that. Uh, blueprints, that would be nice. And then mineral area. That could be pretty nice as well, but I kind of like the sound of this one. Yeah, I kind of like the sound of that one. That one sounds pretty good. We get minerals, we get an object, and we get some blueprints as well if we do it. So, yeah, let's risk it. Risk it for a biscuit. I think that's worth it. But uh, yeah, maybe we'll switch these uh, little cutscenes off. Um, we'll see. But they're fairly short, so you know uh, we could drill the ground. We'll we'll let's do the expedition. Let's do that one. I think if we fail, then we fail. Uh, so we'll add you to the party, and then we'll add you to the party as well. That's great. We've only still got our two people at the moment. So let's go for the gamma anomaly and see what we can find. And then, yeah, we, we really need to... Ooh. There might be something cool there, but that's like asphyxiation. And I don't really don't really want to court that. So... Hmm. Well, the ship's right there. If we get into the trouble... Screw it. Let's go for it. Oh, that's just doing me down. Okay, I thought that was actually a thing. Fair enough. So you've got asphyxiation, so you lose one health... Uh, point for every two rounds. Okay, so you're going to lose some health, right? Fair enough. So yeah, we don't want to. We want to stay. I thought that was like a mineable resource or something. Never mind. Uh, the ship is there. I've got no pointers to anything else though. So let's just keep. Oh, that's going to do me damage. I'm sure. Yeah, that's going to make me bleed. So let's try and avoid that. You've lost the asphyxiation, so that's fine. Ooh, hello. Crashed ship. That's what we want. Let's go in there. We come across a titanic metal structure that at one point must have opened like a flower and begun processing in a vom. 
process of vomiting smaller intricate uh, metal structures uh, only to freeze mid-process. Uh, it appears that an alien terraforming ship lost the battle. Recover materials, attempt repairs. Hmm. So we're going to lose some health, but we're going to get an object or we get a technology. I'm going to go with that. Let's go with that. Shield generator technology blueprint has been added to the database. Ooh, nice. That's pretty cool. I will take that. Keep on moving. And then we get some minerals as well. We probably need to actually... I don't know whether we've actually processed, processed those yet. Found six minerals. Ooh. Let's try and walk around that because I don't want to take... Oh, damn it. I really don't want to take bleed damage. Okay. Let's go this way. See if we can find a way around it. There, that might work. What about... Ah, more minerals. Let's get those. Try and build up a bit more of a stockpile. Maybe we'll... Ooh, hello. Ah, I need another one of those, though. That's a shame. Let's go to that over there. See if we can get to it. Let's keep up. Oh, hello. We'll take that. A box of goodies. What do we get? Uh, found one tea set. Okay. I mean, I love tea, but yeah. A little bit disappointed on that one. I'm not going to lie. Ah, oh, man. Asphyxiation. Oh, we've just got uh, the boost, so we can move further. That's cool. Let's run through that. I think we may have... No, we didn't get any asphyxiation because we uh, ran past it. So that, though, we're going to take some damage on. That we might take damage on. Kind of tempted to come back to this thing over, over here. This is the kind of objective, but he doesn't have enough um, action points because we've just used one. Uh, what do we get out of that? I didn't notice run past it again. Ah, we just took some damage. Okay. Effective by for four rounds? Damn. Okay, that's not good. Heals points for one expedition member. Uh, the cast recovers one. He yeah, okay. Uh, reveals chests to the closest expedition team. Ooh, right. Okay, that's pretty cool. Should we use that? Oh, not possible. Uh, I guess it would have uh, done those anyway. So we've got to keep an eye on that health. Because uh, you're going to take another two damage. Uh, one loss every two rounds. So you're going to take... You're going to go down to two. So let's try and... Let's just move a little bit further. Gotta keep an eye on that. Because if these two die, then that's it. Kind of game over. So... Alright. Next loss in one round. Okay, so you're going to lose one more health if I'm reading that correctly. Should we move there just to see? Yeah, why not? Right, that's it. Right, let's go there. I'll say I don't think we can do anything with this. Yeah, we don't have the things and we don't have anybody to do that. So we've come across the vertical and dug into the sculpted. Yeah, well, let's just search for resources. Uh, we begin a great exploration of the intricate labyrinth. Uh, the network extends tens of miles deep, uh, the very boundaries. Yeah, okay. I don't think we really found much there. Oh no, cruise morale decreased by five. Relaxation pod blueprint has been added. Oh, nice. That was pretty good. Objective reached. Oh, we've boosted the morale back up again as well. Um, kind of want to keep searching just in case. At the moment, we're not really taking any damage or anything or any risk. So, all right, let's let's bring this over. We could walk back there and save five fuel, I guess, but um, it might be worth doing. Looping back round. But for now, let's just get in there. Yes, board the ship. There we go. There is other anomalies that we could ex we could check out as well. Hmm. Although they're going to have to recover, aren't they? So, yeah, let's not do that. So, we found some of that. We found a tea set. We found a drill. Found a small cube, a relaxation pod, and a shield generator. Blueprints, I think, the last two were. So, that's pretty good. Okay, uh, we didn't drill, so let's drill here. Uh, it's going to take my fuel as well. So, okay. So, I'm just going to go five then, because, yeah. There we are, that's good. And we'll just store that in our inventory there. Let's go. And I'm going to leave that then. I think one drill and then just leave it. Let's... Uh, oh, that's the next one. Is that the same one I've just done? Oh, yeah, I've already done that. Can I... 
like switch to another one or something? Or do I have to land? Hmm. Yeah. Well, we can't do anything anyway because they're fatigued, I think. So, yeah, they're like fatigued for two rounds anyway or for two jumps. So, yeah, let's not let's not bother with that. Let's now, because I think there's only one. Yeah, there's only one rocky place. So let's go to the next one. Making our way over there. So we'll go... We'll, we'll go to the black hole, I guess. Ooh, go to the red giant. Yeah, let's go there. I, like Jumping into a black hole just does not seem like a good idea to me. So <laughs> I'm going to avoid it. Uh, ooh, okay, all right. Uh, passing ships in the night. It is impossible to progress into the solar system at the outer edge of the star's gravitational field. Uh, the powerful force field bars any entry. We locate openings of sorts, but it is uh, some kind of alien tenor maintained by an unfamiliar species. Uh, if we try to proceed, uh, what will we find? So we either lose some fuel and gain some oxygen, or we lose some morale and lose some oxygen, or we just try and leave the area. I mean, I don't want to lose fuel. I've got oxygen. Morale's already pretty high anyway, so... Talk with the aliens? Yeah, let's talk with the aliens. Ah, the crew's morale's gone up. Fair enough. And we're into the system. Okay, um... I kind of want to find some fuel, given what happened last time. I kind of want to find some fuel, so I'm going to get out here. Oops, sorry, wrong one. I'm going to get out here and just keep moving towards the next zone. Yeah, let's go there. I don't, uh, I don't want to hang around here. I need. Oh come on, man! I need a fuel planet. Game, come on. Uh, what are we, what are we looking at? So we've only got iron. Uh, we do need to build. Uh, do we have the... Oh, do we not have the refinery blueprint yet? Oh. What do we have? Oh, no, we already have a refinery. Yeah, never mind. Ignore me. There we go. That's cool. Let's process this stuff up. Get a few little bits. Although... Hmm. Now I'm doing this, to be honest, you're probably better off just leaving them in um, stacks because... I've just made. I've just processed all of those materials that took one stack, and now that's taken basically two stacks, isn't it? Or it's an extra stack of um, storage space, if that makes sense. So, hmm. Yeah, we might not want that sick bay. That's not bad. That's pretty good. Um, yeah. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna leave this place because I really want some fuel. So, given what happened last time, blue giant. Oh, do you know what? I need to assign someone to the crew slots, don't I, as well? Yeah. Of the ship. Uh, near the edge of the solar system, we notice a dimensional rift forming. This could be an activated door of night. Uh, can we take it? But it will uh, be a one-way journey. Go through the door. Yeah, screw it. Let's go through the door. The captain orders to go through the rift. Ship has moved elsewhere. Oh. Oh, damn it to a bloody rocky planet. <laughs> Okay, all right. Uh, let's assign you to... I mean, I guess the Cosmic Folder reduces the amount of fuel consumed. Ooh, that's definitely the one to go for. The Navigator, and then we'll get you onto... Increases the range, increases the chance of refining minerals into resources, increases the probability of finding resources... Probably finding resources when drilling. Well, I think that one's a good one to go for, isn't it? I wonder how many crew members we can get. I have no idea. I'm going to leave here because I need fuel. So without fuel, I'm kind of screwed. Let's go there. I know the thing's really close by, but without fuel, we're kind of screwed. Without some resources, I don't want to take, um, take that new place. Yes, gas giant. Perfect. That's what we want. Going to take some damage, but still, I think it's worth it. Fuel was our main concern. We need to build up a stack of fuel and iron and oxygen, etc. So, yeah, the question is because it cost us seven, we got back a decent amount there. And we'll just drop that all in there as well. Do we probe again? I don't think we're going to probe again. Let's, pro let's go five and we'll see how much do we actually make more than we got back. So, we got eight. So we did make like three, but you're obviously putting wear on the probe. So, uh, you know, the, 
the energy, the you know the um, uh, the quality of it uh, is going to go down. Eventually, have to repair it. So I think probably just one probe is all that's worth it, in my opinion. But I don't know, maybe not. But yeah, three gas giants. That's nice. That is nice. And then let's do that again. I'm going to go like eight this time. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. That's a nice one, isn't it? And then we'll drop that in there because that's worth a lot more. I think that's like 10. Yeah, it's like hydrogen is 2 fuel. 1 hydrogen, 2 fuel. 1 helium is 10 fuel. So yeah, we're we're okay on that one. Uh, oxygen. I don't have any other ones. I think if you've got it in your cargo hold, it tells you. So yeah, that's fine. And then we'll go to the next zone and just build up a big stack of fuel. And then we'll try and get some oxygen and we'll try and get some iron together. I think those are the three things we need uh, before we go and try and take that uh, ship. I think that's a good idea. A little bit slower. Yeah, it's in a used condition already, so it's going to break. Drop those in there and then we'll go there. That's great. I'm going to probably convert one of these into... I could turn that into like storage. I might do that. We don't need it yet, but I probably will do that eventually. Uh, technology as well. We got a shield generator, but we don't have any of that stuff. Um, what else did we get? Didn't we get something else? Oh, relaxation pod. That's it. So we get extra comfort from that, but we need silicon. So yeah, I think that's probably once we get a bigger ship or something together, that might be uh, that might be more worth it. Let's come out of there. Oops, sorry, wrong one. No, we've done them all. That's fine. So let's work our way towards this one. So we go there. Ooh, there's a line as well. Interesting. I don't remember that before. Slowly make our way there. I think that's a good idea. We'll get some, get some fuel together. Try and get some oxygen and some iron and stuff. There we go. That's perfect. And we might be able to find um, some anomalies to uh, scan. I think they're only on D2. Uh, obviously on these solid rocky um, formations obviously you're not going to do any expeditions in a gas giant um, it's these rocky ones and the uh, oxygen ones that you can walk about on uh, so land and let's do some drilling yeah with this drill as well Ooh, this is a bright one isn't it yeah with the drill obviously you've got to land as well so that's a bit of extra fuel to consider and then yeah the drill costs fuel as well as the probe so yeah I'm kind of getting that now I'm going to go 8. There we go. That's great. Let's transfer all of that. Not worried about the hull at the moment. So that's okay. Uh, silicon. So we could... Uh, sorry. Could No, we can't build a shield generator or anything like that. Uh, the relaxation pod. We, I wouldn't mind that, but I don't think... This is probably just a temporary ship, so I don't want to do any upgrades on it. Um, I think we'll kind of leave that. Let's not stay here any longer. We'll just take off, I think. And we'll go to the next one because there are two here. So let's do that. Yeah, I like this game. really like it. Kind of, uh, I don't know what you guys think to it. But uh, yeah, I'm digging it so far. I really enjoyed the uh, beta though in last summer. It was really good fun. Uh, there we go. Anomaly. Nope. Oh, wow, they're really close by. Okay, scan completed. So we've got that one. Omega, I think the Omega did like... Um, uh, it, it could do anything, I think, if I remember rightly. Oh, that's what it did in the beta anyway. If you needed oxygen or hull or whatever, you could drop that in and it would fill in the gap. And then that is... So, blueprint, object, and minerals. Fever, they've both got the same thing. I kind of like the blueprints. I kind of like the blueprint. I'm going to go for the blueprint. And obviously we'll do a drill here as well. And get some more resources. But I think we'll go out for the expedition first and see what we get. Um, you know, I think that's a good idea. It seems like I have to take off every time to go to it. I guess we're landing at the expedition site, aren't we? I, I would guess that that's what it is. We've got to then take off, go back to orbit and land at the next one. Would be my guess. So we're going to add you to party because you're not tired anymore. Oh. Oh. There we go. That's good. And so uh, what else do we get? Because we got some... We got a drill. So the geo radar gives a... Um, 
Gives a resource vein, yeah. Uh, when a point of interest is explored, plus one raw materials is gained. Ooh, I kind of like the sound of that. Yeah, let's go with that. And then your... Uh, your doodad here. Ah, you've only got that. Okay, I don't know what the T thing was. Oh, is that it? Oh, no, we've already got it. Okay, never mind. Herbal tea. Oh, that costs four plant fibers, if I'm, if I'm reading that correctly. I see, and then they're like... Um, Specific to like the engineer role and the survivalist and that sort of thing. Okay, all right, that's fine. We don't have any plants, so I don't think the herbal tea is going to do anything. But you never know; we might find some plants. Right. Well, I don't want to go that way because I'm going to take some damage. Um, let's head this way. Great. And we're going to take some. I'm not walking through that. Yeah, there we go. That's fine. I'm going to try and just avoid damage wherever I can. We'll just snake around the place. Um, I wouldn't mind trying to walk back to the ship because that would save us five fuel, wouldn't it? So it might be an idea to try and do that if we can. Okay, ooh. Oh, there we go. That is possibly what we were looking for, I'm going to say. Yeah, I don't want to go there. Survivor Ethics. Let's go there then. Uh, at the foot of the hill we find a remarkable rock formation. It resembles large blocks of limestone, uh, but they radiate, they radiate heat and slowly pulsate. Wow. Uh, could it be alive? Uh, of great interest is the fact that the geological readings indicate a small quantity of omega present in each of the rock stones. Uh, a lot of stone blocks, sorry. Uh, this would appear to confirm that the mysterious link between omega and sentient life, which uh, we have found again. Watch we do analyze the structure of the blocks. It's going to use up all of his um, action points, but I think it's worth it. For a brief geological survey, our engineer produces an interesting hypothesis. They believe the stones form a living city that extends in all directions, interconnected and stretching. Not far below our current location, the engineer believes they have located some sort of cemetery. Yeah, interesting. Okay, do we get any Omega from that? Oh, we found some Omega though, but he's lost all his action points. That's pretty cool. Uh, I don't want to go that way. That way is going to go back to the ship. Hmm. Alright. I think that's okay to go this way. Ooh, hello. Ah, yeah, I can't do anything with that. Is there any way of upping my action points? Yeah, heals too. Yeah, not much I can do about that. That's a, that's a shame. I guess we could just try and scavenge. I don't think we're going to be able to do much there, but, you know. Might get something out of it. Search for resources. Yeah, it's the same thing again. Lost some morale, but... Uh, oh, mess hall blueprint. Okay, interesting. Objective reach. And so the morale has gone back up again. All right, let's keep on going. Aha, some minerals. That's kind of what I wanted. More minerals. We could take some damage. I think we'll be okay. We can risk it. Is that 25% chance? I think that might be a 25% chance. Yeah, I think it's 25% chance. Okay, that's fine. That's worth a shot. And then I'm going to try and walk back to the ship rather than use the fuel. Actually, we could just explore this a little bit. Is there any more left to explore? I think we may have actually explored this area. Yeah. Let's run back through. Our crew is affected for four rounds. So you are going to take two points. Oh my god. Oh boy. For the next four rounds. Dang. Okay, alright. That's not good. Oh. Health lost. Points in the three rounds. Okay, so you're not going to take it just yet. Um, I kind of just want to go here and just see. Yes, there we go. There is a box. Okay, there we are. Found a pain suppressor, an alien textbook. Uh, we could hit that off. So we should lose two health points. So we should be okay. Let's keep on going. She's going to lose a bit. She's going to go down to half health. Missed. Again, we could just search and try and get some more resources. Gather resources. Uh, Expedition encounters a swamp and pushes deeper into the region. A geological survey suggests uh, mineral deposits just below the surface. As we begin boring samples, we disturb the area. Swamp surface, a thick mist. That sounds bad, doesn't it? 
Yeah, I'm just going to leave. Cruise morale's to decreased. Fair dues. I'm okay with that. And then we'll... Yeah. Well, I don't want to end on that. Ooh. Let's risk it. Sergei is effective for two rounds. It's okay. One health loss. Points every two rounds. Okay. I think that was worth it. I don't want to stop on that because that just, you know, that seems really bad, doesn't it? So let's run. Crew is effective for swiftness for one round. And then we'll get back in the ship. I think that's the way to go. Get back to the ship without spending five fuel. I think that's probably a better way of doing it. And I was say I'm probably going to take this a little bit slower. I feel like I maybe rushed to the uh, ship a bit too quick. Um, getting some other resource together would be good. Yes, we found an Omega, we found a pain suppressor, alien textbook, got a mess hall blueprint. That's pretty cool. I like it. It's good. Did I drill? I can't remember if I drilled now. I don't think I did. Ooh, there we are. Let's transfer all of that. We may as well dump that in the hole then. And we'll get that going. And the Omega. Uh, this resource can be found on stars and so on. Yeah, as I say, you can drop it in any one of these and it will uh, it will restock for you. So I'm going to convert this over to a storage slot. And I'll put that in there because, as I say, I don't really think I'm going to do much with this uh, ship. I'm going to just try and stack as many resources as I can on it before we, get, before we swap over to the other ship because I think it's just going to be a better one to go for. So let's take off. And then I think I've already been... Yeah, I've been to those. So the next one is there. Let's go to that ship. Let's go to this blue giant before we go to the ship. Oh, we could... I guess we could have done the other expedition as well, but never mind. Ooh, there we are. I could probably do with some oxygen, actually. We've got the Omega, and we do have some oxygen, I think, in storage. Anyway, do we have some... We've got the Omega anyway, so we can always use that. That might just get us out of a hole. Uh, let's probe. Yeah, the condition's a bit broken. Gonna go, like, really... There we go. As deep as I can. There we are, that's fine. Could just drop those in there as well and really stack that up. Yeah, there we go. That's good. I think then we'll go to the next one. I think it's possibly worth that, although it might not be. Uh, that was four, and then if I spend eight, so I spent 12, that makes sense. But hopefully I'm going to make more than that back. I'm going to go nine. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. That's pretty good, isn't it? Transfer that all. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we've got a nice little stack of fuel. These are worth 10 as well, so we've got 50 fuel. We've also got that. Yeah, just some oxygen would be really nice now. Um... Could go there. Yeah, let's just quickly check the giant out. And then we'll go to the ship. It's blue giant. Uh, uh, soft, malleable shapes are becoming stuck to the exterior of the ship. Our engineer tells us that strange particles are doing a lot of damage to the hull. They advise us to get rid of them quickly, dissolve them, or accelerate the ship. Accelerate the ship? Hmm. Accelerate the ship. Uh, Captain accelerates the ship, pushing the engines to the limit. Uh, unknown particles, life forms, however, the emergency trajectory takes us off our planned course and we have drifted. Oh, great. Ship has moved elsewhere. Oh, great. Oh, wow. Oh, well, it did, did bring us to an oxygen planet, so I guess that's not that bad. But yeah, that's not exactly what I wanted, but there we go. Hmm. I wonder if there isn't a, a, a thing there because I don't have a crew member that. Uh, it's like the Z Xeno, or the Xeno linguist, whatever it is. Uh, the other class of character, maybe one of those could help us out. Uh, there's nothing here anyway, so we may as well just go down and drill. And we should get a stack of oxygen, if nothing else. Yeah, I think this is probably take your time a little bit and stack up some more resources before you go to that uh, other ship. I think that's probably a good idea. Let's drill. That's got to break soon as well, surely. Wow, is that it? Oh, is that? Oh, wow. My, oh, yeah, yeah. If you land on a planet, of course. If you land on a planet, all of your um, re, your your bars get refilled. Let's convert that as well to a storage slot. And then we'll put that on there as well. 
yeah, so we instantly get a refill anyway of oxygen uh, when we could, when we land on the planet because obviously you open the hatches and just let all the oxygen in, I guess. So, yeah, that makes sense. That's pretty cool, though. I think we'll leave it at that and we'll take off. Could do another one. Hmm. I think it's probably worth it. Let's do it. I don't think you get iron on these planets, unfortunately, which is a bit of a shame. Yeah, hull's taken a bit of a beating, though. That's my only concern. Um, but we should be okay. Uh, the other ship, I think we could repair with copper. I wonder if it's this ship. We can't do that. Uh, this has got to break soon as well. Drill down. Damage. Yeah, there we go. I just called it. Let's repair that for one iron. And then cobalt as well. Oh, let's throw that let's throw the let's throw that in there that's that gets rid of a stack of stuff then doesn't it that's fine yeah and the copper can't do anything with that unfortunately and do that though I like that it just shows you what you can use it's pretty cool yeah that's good right anyway we gotta we gotta make our oops sorry wrong one we gotta make our way to that to that uh, new ship so yeah, we can't go there, so we got to make our way back, unfortunately. So, let's do that. Oh, boy, yeah. Uh, ooh. Okay, uh, discover new life, new civilizations. We're within the orbit of a distant star at the center of the ring asteroids. We discover what appears to be a multi-species uh, hangout for marginal types. It is a large base constructing of floated ships. There is uh, almost certainly something of interest to be found here. Okay, so we get an object and lose some oxygen, or we lose some morale, steal their resources, refuse to meet them. Let's let's get some. Let's get this object. I think that's probably the way to go. Uh, found a diamond apple. Interesting. Oxygen has dropped by forty. Ooh, hello. Civilized planet, rich in resources. Hello. And we've also got one of those. I think we want to go there first because uh, we're hurting on uh, resources. We could fix up the hull would be a good one to go for so I think that's a good good call we don't want to do ooh as a as an anomaly as well okay yeah, we're close no oh, back up there there we go found it mineral area all right I mean that's not bad I think we've got loads of minerals anyway haven't we so um that would not necessarily be a bad thing uh, I wonder if we could leave the ship there, fix it up a bit more before we transferred over and just took everything apart off this one. That could be a good idea. Uh, let's do this expedition, I think. Yeah, let's go for the expedition. It's just minerals, so... It's, you know, not brilliant, but hey-ho. Wow, they level up really slow as well, don't they? Damn. Okay. Let's do this thing. He's got his drill, so he should get a bit more minerals. So, oh wow, look at that! Minerals everywhere. Dang. Swiftness is activated as well, so we've got a little bit more there. And there we go. That's great. Let's just explore. I'll say I think I'm going to try and walk back to the ship. Uh, that's my plan. Swiftness is activated again. Just saves us five fuel. If we get desperate, then, you know, we can call the ship back. Ooh, hello. That's good. Dang. This is not actually that bad, is it? Uh, we found a small cube and a flask. Interesting. Yeah, I'm really, really enjoying this game. You know, kind of chilled out and on the one hand, but uh, intense on the other, I guess. Uh, yeah, pretty cool. Right, what's around here? Make our way down here. Yeah, we'll try to say we'll try and walk back to the ship. I think that's the way to go, rather than calling it over. Just five resources. A holographic scanner. Okay. Ooh, a wreck. Hello, crashed ship. Let's go and have a look. See what we can do here. Uh, ooh. Okay, we come across the titanic metal structure that at one point must have been. Uh, Opened like a flower and begin the process. Of, ah, right, it's the same thing. So we get an object and lose morale, or we just get more minerals. 
Hmm. What's that? What's that morale at? I can't. Don't know what the morale's at. I think maybe go for the. Let's go for the minerals. Found ten minerals. Woo, that's pretty good. Dang, we're going to be doing all right on that. It's not bad. Got to process it all, but still, it's pretty good. Yes, yeah, so we found everything there. Got swiftness is activated. There we are. Have some more minerals. Damn, we're going to have a lot of minerals. Can find a bot, another box. That'd be really nice. I don't want too much. Just you know. Okay. And then, yeah, I'll say, I think I'm just going to run back. I think that's the way to go. Uh, just save the uh, ooh, swiftness activated. That gives us an extra bit of movement. That's great. Because uh, she's carrying this, uh, I think it's that thing. She's carrying something that uh, helps anyway with that. So that's good. Well, let's go there. Yep, board the ship. That's great. Got a little bit of experience. We got uh, harvested 10. Oh, yeah, there we go. Uh, that was just the experience gain. Fair enough. Wow, 40 minerals. We found a flask, found a holographic scanner, and a small cube. Interesting. I will take all of that stuff. I wonder if we can sell some of that stuff. Um, ooh. All right. Well, let's enter the refinery. And should we just process as much of this as we can? Might as well. Let's just process away. We can get rid of a stack and probably most of it is going to be the resources that we've already got for the most part. Uh, thorium. Yeah, apart from that, I think everything else we've got. So that's pretty good. Yeah, I think everything else does look like we've got it. Ah, gold. Fair enough. We may need to convert that into a, uh, into a storage slot as well. Damn. Transfer all of that. There we go. Oh, damn. Hafnium as well. Okay, yeah. Alright. But we'll have a storage slot there free. So that's good. And then we can chuck that at the um, at the hull. Let's repair that straight away. Um, can I like split the stack? Divide. No, 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 no. I don't want to do that. Transfer all of that. Uh, I've got these two slots, so I guess I could put the rest of my fuel in there. That would give me another slot. And then if we turn that... Ah, oh, man, I can't convert that whilst I'm in here. Uh, a rare metal, a common metal. Hmm. Ooh, no, hang on. We used to create the most interesting electronic components. Uh, reactors and energy conversions. I think I'm just going to have to ditch that. We'll have to ditch that, unfortunately. Could put that in there, I guess. And Yeah, let's put that in there. And then we'll take all that with us. That's good. That's great. Right, perfect. Brilliant. Right, I think, though, did we drill? I can't remember if we drill. I don't think we did. Let's do that. I think we'll do this, and then I was going to call it here, so... Uh, let's transfer all of that over and then we'll put the rest of that into the hull and repair that up. That's great. We've got a full stack of iron. We've got a stack of um, copper, uh, sorry, oxygen. The only thing we don't have is fuel, but I think everything else we're doing okay with. Uh, do we probably, we might not need all of these resources just yet, but, um, you know, I think it's good to have them about because um, we've got to build some of these uh, other things like, uh, you know, um, uh, like the refiner and stuff. I don't think that that ship that we took over last time had that. It might be a different ship, though, this time. Uh, but anyway, I'll say, I think for now, though, this is where we're going to call it, and we're going to end the episode here. So if you like that one, please give me a thumbs up, comment your thoughts down below, subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone, and I'll catch you next time.